guys. So we're going to do another unboxing for you. Uh, we've got crack and dice for you as usual. And at the end, we are going to showcase one of our favorite dice makers. He makes artisan handcrafted dice. It is Casey from Electron. Uh, we're going to do a different format. We're kind of experimenting with stuff. So instead of it being you guys watching us and us holding up the dice, we're going to do top down. So you guys actually get to see it. And I get to show off one of my Valentine's Day presents that I love. Um, all right, let's get started. So the first dice set that we're going to work with, um, actually, let me show you these first. I don't know if you could see them earlier, but they have really cute stickers and patches. We're kind of collecting. We have a stack of it like that thick. So the first dice set, we actually unboxed this in an earlier one, but you didn't really get a close up look. So if I can get the <clears throat> okay, so this set came in a burlap bag instead of the velvet, just kind of going along with the story. And these little guys have little beans in them. The story that went with it was absolutely precious, and this was actually um, a charity set that was designed. Uh, the proceeds were donated to purchase meals to feed the hungry. One set purchased 100 meals. <clears throat> this is a really cute one. You can actually see the different beans that are in here. So this set was called Little Bean. The story uh, is probably still on the website. I'm sure that the listing for the dice are still on the website. They may actually still have some. Like we said in our earlier video, they may actually still have some of these to purchase. But as you can tell, uh, the inking is just a gorgeous green and then all of the little beans inside are super clear and they're different kinds. My favorite are the little red ones because I think you can see those the clearest. Um, along with the green. And then there's little tan ones, uh, white and little peas. It looks like or lentils, something like that. So that's the first one. Okay, so I don't know what's in these bags. Literally just took them out of the package. We'll see which set this is. Okay, this is an incredible set. This is called Fate. This was designed um, during the Kickstarter. This was a special backer level, and it was designed by somebody named Chad Bortle. Uh, I hope I'm pronouncing the last name correctly. Um, <clears throat> he got some community involvement on the colors of the palette for this dice and there's actually a special card that goes with it uh, called Fate and there's your spell card on the back of it and the artwork was also done um, specifically just for this dice. Uh, we'll put the name of the artist in the description below um, along with, I think she has a red bubble. We'll link her red bubble also so you guys can check out her art. But the set is just absolutely stunning. The uh, dice are full of glitter um, and then you'd see the different colorways. Um, it's just gorgeous. And this is, there's only a thousand sets printed. Um, it's not going to be offered again. I think there might be some left on the website, I don't know. Um, but this was a very specific backer level that only uh, Chad purchased during the Kickstarter. And purchasing it allowed him to actually design and, and pick his own custom set. So Kraken didn't have anything to do with the design of the dice um, whatsoever. That was all Chad um, and the community. He very awesomely included community input in the making of the dice. So that is Fate. <clears throat> and uh, we'll move these out of the way. There's another set of dice. Uh, these ones were released, I think, two weeks ago. Normally the releases are done on Thursdays. Oh, I love it. So this is a sea glass set. This is meant to be matte. It's supposed to look like this. They're not supposed to be shiny. They're supposed to be reminiscent of sea glass. Um, this is, I believe, the fourth set. Um, this one is mermaid. There's cobalt. There's Tahitian 
Sunset and Sealy was also a sea glass set, I think. Don't quote me on the Sealy one. I don't know if that one was actually a sea glass. So this could be this could be the third set, but this is stunning. There's this gorgeous deep blue, a teal, a very light faint one, and then a kind of a light greenish blue. Um, just looks absolutely gorgeous, like the colors of the ocean um, in the Caribbean. And all of the pieces are this just gorgeous, it looks like sea glass. It actually looks like they're made of sea glass. So this um, is one of the first sets that they've made that already came with the boosters, which is the much bigger D20 and the little tiny baby guy. I don't know the millimeter size of these. I should for the sheer number of them that I have, but I don't. Um, however, this is the normal size for Kraken, and this is the big guy. So these are just stunning. This, I think this is one of my favorite. I thought Cobalt was my favorite, but this one I think is my favorite sea glass set. Um, normally when we do these unboxings, we only show you guys the dice, the new dice that we've purchased. Um, but today I wanna actually kinda do a little bit of a spotlight just so you guys can see that gorgeous D2. Hold it in the center. Um, the gorgeous D2, uh, again, just perfect. I mean, it, it actually looks like a piece of sea glass that you found. So I want to do a spotlight on another artist that makes absolutely incredible dice. He's one of our, one of our all time favorites. And these dice are dice that we featured in RageCon. Um, <clears throat> let me actually move this one that we featured in RageCon. And, um, his name is Casey Cookman. It's called Electron Dice. And these dice are I can't even explain to you how stunning they are. I'm really hoping that the camera is picking up on the internal glow and glitter. Now there's two different sets in here. So I have one that's like a multicolor rainbow and um, that's this set. So you can see kind of a rainbow sparkle throughout it. And then I have another one that it, I don't know, it, to me it looks like there's a nebula or a kind of a, a star dust or something in the middle. There's a purple shimmer and then um, absolutely incredible hollow glitter throughout each piece. So these are artisan handcrafted dice. Um, he makes these hand every single piece by hand. Um, the numbering is engraved and um, he makes custom sets. You can order them. It's called Electron Dice. Um, he does have some on his Etsy but these have to be some of the most beautiful, some of the most beautiful sets that we own. And again, that's Casey and with Electron Dice. Uh, that's it, guys.